tools needed are a straight slot screwdriver, a number two Phillips screwdriver, a pair of cutters, an M4 Allen wrench, and some zip ties. For the removal of the Jazzy Air joystick, you need to make sure that your Jazzy Air is in its fullest upright position. Pull your shroud off. Remove your left battery by unscrewing the battery box. Unstrapping the battery. Disconnect it and take it out of the chair. Everything you will need will be on the left side of the chair. We want to remove the IGUS chain with your straight slot screwdriver by just popping off from the top portion and the bottom. Just be careful because it is plastic not to break it. Now you'll be able to access the zipper part of the chain and you just want to take your straight slot screwdriver and just carefully reach it in and pop one side of the chain off. Remove your harness from the chain and now you'll need your Phillips head screwdriver to remove this clip that holds the harness to the frame. So unscrew it and now disconnect your joystick from your power module. Now take your cutters and cut all the wire, pre-existing wire ties that hold your joystick harness in place. Just be careful not to cut your, cut your harness. Take your M4 Allen wrench to the set screw and loosen it up and remove your inline mount for your joystick. So take your number two Phillips head screwdriver and just remove your joystick from the inline mount and loosen up the two Phillips screws that hold your light switch in place and now remove your joystick from the mount. Now with your new joystick, place it back on your inline mount. I recommend doing it first so this way your light switch holds the harnessing in place. Take a small zip tie and hold them in place. Make sure you cut it flush. And now begin your steps in reverse. So slide your inline mount back in the armrest. Use your M4 Allen wrench to tighten it down. You want to make sure it's straight before you tighten it. So now you're going to want to put your clip back on that holds the harness to the frame. You want to reattach your joystick to the harness for the power module. Plug it in. Place the clip back on. Reattach the clip back to the frame and just tighten it down. And now you can begin to feed your harnessing back through the IGUS chain. Just make sure all your harnessing is in there and together, including the harness for your air button. And just start clipping them one at a time. And just make sure you have enough slack for your harnessing so this way it's not so tough getting it back in. Do the same with the top, just reattach it. Make sure your harnessing is in the center. And 
And now, put your battery back in and reattach it. Now, just finish the curing, your harnessing. So this way, keep them out of any pinch points. Cut out the excess flush. Turn the joystick on. Make sure it powers up and all your functions work. And that is the replacement of the joystick on the Jazzy Air.